lot of people ask me what type of kicker motor they should get for their boat. And there's a couple of options. One is you can get the kicker motor that's tied into your big motor through a connection bar and you operate it from your steering wheel at the front of the boat or a tiller motor. And I happen to like the tillers better because that's just kind of who I am. But let me show you the options you have with this particular motor. You can get it in a standard length, a long shaft, or like this, an extra long shaft to help you control and position the boat and present the baits to the fish. The reason I like the extra long shaft like this is I get a complete thrust underneath the boat when I'm back trolling or when I'm forward trolling. If the propeller's too far up, I'll throw some of that thrust into the transom of the boat, which causes inefficiencies when you're back trolling especially. So when you're considering a kicker motor, first off, you need to decide where you want to fish from, the console or from the back, and then what's the depth of your transom. 25 inch transom, long or extra long shaft. On a standard height transom, you can get away with the standard length shaft on a kicker motor.